moments that I feel alive. Those are the moments where I'm so in tune to who you are. I can feel the vibe. Huh? Good. Uh, what are you doing? Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Savage. Dude. That's okay. What do you have to say for you? Oh, all right. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Here. What do you have to say for yourself? You dropped it. Yeah, yeah okay. Uh huh. What else? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then? Oh, okay. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. Don't drop it. Oh, thank you. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. We're in the back corner of Olive Garden and nobody's up here. So <laughs> he dropped it. <laughs> You're so cute. Okay, let's keep it up. Gotta go. Oh my gosh, okay. So, Neri would put his food into go boxes or in a to go box and I was still eating mine and so he had closed both of the boxes and we paid or whatever and he said okay well let's go and so the waiter came and like picked up our food or in our plates and so I just threw napkins and stuff onto my plate without putting it in a to go box and we get in the car <laughs> and Neri's food is in that one <laughs> but I brought an empty to go box <laughs> and I feel really stupid because I was like, I didn't bring my food to go, but then I have two boxes. And Mary quoted Spongebob, um, Patrick saying, say Wait on my chocolate. <laughs> we reference Spongebob all the time. Um, a few days ago I said that I was going to go to the church and set up Elijah's baptism date. But I didn't do it, so we're going to do it today. Yes, we have to. Why? Because, do you want our son to be baptized or not? Yes. Well then, get it together. He's gonna knock out as soon as he gets home. And then we said like, we were going home. But he's gonna knock out here in a minute. Okay. Go, you can put him in the stroller. Excuse me. Oh. <laughs> Good morning, guys. <laughs> it's actually about... Guys, I have such a mess behind me. I haven't... I didn't clean yesterday. Um, what was I saying? It's not morning, it's like 12 something. Um, Elijah had breakfast, lunch, we both woke up late. Um, I just made a big circle. But um, I have to get ready. Don't have any makeup on, so I probably look dead. <coughs> I think I'm getting sick, if y'all didn't just hear that nasty cough. But um, I hope I hope not because Elijah just got over being sick. I just got over being sick and I had like a stomach bug or something. Um, and I realized that in one of my vlogs, two of them, okay, the first one I had, I told y'all that I didn't vlog it all that day or for like the past two days. Um, and I was going to include why in the vlog after that. But I tried to use um, my old SD card that didn't work in this camera and it was just, I guess, a bad SD card that didn't work and I filmed on that because my other SD card was in my computer and I left it um, 
So I tried to use that one, but the footage didn't um, keep on the card or didn't like save on the card or anything, of course. But I had the stomach bug on Valentine's Day. <sighs> that was not fun, but yeah, so that's what I got sick with. So this time I think I'm getting like a cold. <sighs> Hope not, but it is what it is. I have to get ready and I have to go. Today's Thursday, I have to go to my old high school actually. Um, I need community service hours, and my old orchestra director, um, he always just gives me my hours. Like, I'll, I'll go and, like, sort music for him or something. Basically, just talk to him for, like, an hour and a half, and he gives me whatever hours. So, hopefully, I can get ready real quick. I'm going to leave Elijah with my mom, and then I'll probably pick me and him up some Starbucks. And, yeah, I'm going to go do that. And then I have to go to class at 8.30 again, and I have to I have a lot of things to do. I have to edit. I filmed a, it's like a tips video. Um, I did a collab with my friend Pam, and I'll link her video in my description box. Um, we met in college, and she was really fun, and I love her. She has a little girl. Her name's Jay, Jaylin. Um, sorry. Her name's Jaylin, and she does vlogs as well on her own little videos, and we're doing a kind of like a time management uh, set of videos, so I'm doing time management when you have a baby while going to school and she's just doing time management with a baby in general um, and so that'll be up hopefully before this vlog um, I still have some things to do and I really want to work hard on this video so it might be after but yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and try to get ready and get things done guys look at my life and my makeup collection like this is what I use, all the brushes and stuff that I use every day. All of this. One here. These are all palettes, palettes, lip liners, liquid lips, more palettes, beauty stuff, skincare, nail polish, more makeup. This drawer is freaking broken since high school, but and more makeup, lipsticks, palettes, color pop, lipsticks, palettes, face foundations, BB creams, powders, <laughs> my Selena collection. Um, more palettes, eyeshadow, quads, more face powders. I have a problem. Once there's pride and my eyes can no longer see Suppose no ocean colors, I'm left with a color that's bloody Red like the anger of a boy as I never miss my mark Alcohol has me so involved in the honor of young bloods, let me start You ain't gotta put the gear, we ain't got one neither You ain't gotta put the gear, we ain't got one neither We ain't got one neither So, 
undressed, changed, excuse, all of this mess back there. Haven't made the bed. Haven't done anything again. Still haven't cleaned this freaking mirror. Um, I'm a mess. I'm a mess, guys. Okay, so I'm just wearing a basic tee from Old Navy and this pretty like mint kind of green, kind of blue, um, basic t-shirt, American Eagle jeans, it's an Eric's guitar, <laughs> um, these sandals, let me see, um, are from Target, I believe, I think they're like the Sam and Libby, I got them a long time ago though, um, and that's really it, just in the Kendra Scott necklace, my rings, charm bracelet from James Avery, and my watch, through my hair in a braid, everyday makeup, good to go. So I'm running kind of late going to my um, old high school. Um, it's like 1.30. I was hoping to get there around 1. But I had to get Elijah fed and stuff and change for my mom so that because she still has my niece during the day. So, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. Um, and then I like scarfed down two tacos <laughs> um, and a Sprite. And now I'm headed over there. I have to throw a cardigan on, which... I mean, I'm okay with because it makes you look like you're more dressed up than you really are. But I walked into my garage and it's like 60s outside, which is kind of cold for me in West Texas in general. <coughs> uh, but yeah, so I threw on a cardigan. I think this one's from Charlotte Roos. And yeah, so I'm going to head over there. I wanted to get Starbucks from me and them, but I'm already running late. So I think I'm just going to wait and then just get me something afterwards. Whoops, guys, I'm gonna cry. I am sitting in my old orchestra director's office. Outside is our practice room that we used to, that I had for school when we did our practices and our rehearsals, and I was just on the stage. I'll put my Snapchat clip I have on there because I don't want to go back over there. But, oh my gosh. Y'all didn't know this about me. I haven't talked about it. I used to play the violin in high school. I started sixth grade um, and all the way to my senior year of high school. And I tried to play my freshman year of high school, but I was just too busy with work, and it just didn't work out. <laughs> um, and I miss it so much. I really have, I don't even remember the last time I picked up my violin. Um, and it was so fun. It was like one of my best memories I have of high school, if not the best. Like, this is the only reason I miss high school, is for the orchestra and the friends I created, and my directors, and the, it, we were a family. Um, and it's crazy being back in here. I mean, I've been back in here before. I'm a freaking junior in college. Like, <laughs> I still live in the same town um, that I went to high school in. And it's crazy being in here and just all these memories just flow back. And I love it. And then I'll go home and, like, look at all my pictures. And I'll probably listen to a recording of us in the car when I leave. Um, but it's, it's crazy, guys. Like, crazy. Um... And I feel so old, and now I have a baby, <laughs> um, and it's crazy. And my orchestra director, he seriously impacted my life like no other. Him and my other one. There was two. One of them is gone now, but the main orchestra director is still here. Um, and I thank them with everything I have. Like, without them in this program, I don't know what my high school life would have been like and what friends I would have had like that's how much this program means to me and I literally I want to cry like it's crazy and I love them so so much um and it's crazy like all the things we used to do the fundraisers the um get togethers we would do lock-ins here at the school um we had a duck race which is like rubber ducks and we put them in a pond um He's looking at me record myself. Um, and it was crazy. And I think I'm going to do community service with him, so I'm going to get off of my soapbox and go help him out. I was recording myself, and some high school kids worked out, so I stopped. Let me make sure no one's in here. I shouldn't be in here, but I am. This is our old rehearsal room. I'm going to try to not show anything that has our school name on it. But I'm depressed. I miss it so much. I had a good talk with my old professor, and I mean, what? A <laughs> good talk with my old director. Um, I'm walking out of the high school. There's people. <sighs> I 
and yeah, it always brings back such good memories coming to the school and I love that I'm so close that I can still do this and I feel like a freaking high school hero but this is such a big part of my life so I will never forget it.